Hi, my name is Sarah Smith and I'm a horticulturalist here at Rogers Gardens and today we're going to talk about peonies. I bet you thought you couldn't grow peonies, but we actually can. Um, I get a lot of people coming in looking for peonies, especially anybody who's lived back east. Uh, you grow beautiful peonies back there. Um, but we don't get the chill and the cold that a traditional peony needs. Um, so it's a struggle to grow a regular peony. They'll never really flower for us. But we can grow Ito peonies. So Ito peonies is a little bit different. This is an intersectional peony. So it's a cross between the tree peony and a very herbaceous peony. Um, it, it's a fairly new thing on the market. Uh, it was developed in 1940. And um, so it's something that we're just really starting to see. So it's a really new concept for a lot of gardeners. And actually it's super duper easy. You'll be really surprised. So we sell them here in two different forms. What you see in front of you is one that's really starting to come out so beautifully and so nicely. You don't have to stake them when they get this big, which is pretty amazing. And this has buds just ready to go. Um, so this one's really nice and grown out already, but we also sell them in a bare root style. So you can buy boxes like this. Um, this is just the roots inside the box. So it's very similar to like planting a bulb, basically. The real key, whether you're buying one that's grown out or you're buying one like this, is you wanna make sure you don't plant it too deep. That's the biggest problem. If you plant that crown too deep, you're not gonna get flowers on it. So you wanna make sure that the crown of the root ball is just a little bit above the soil level of the existing lying soil. And if you're planting it here in the box, you're reading the instructions in the back. And I suggest get a ruler, do it right. Cause you don't want to spend the money on something like this and then wait for spring and nothing happens and you're really disappointed. Uh, so it gives all the planting instructions in the back here. Ito peonies can be a little bit on the pricey side. They are newer and it's something that's taken a long time to really develop. So a box that, like this is gonna run you about $20. Um, when you buy them grown like this, you're gonna run anywhere from like 70 to about $100, but it's so worth it and they're super easy. If you do it right and you plant it right and in the right spot, you basically just plant it and forget it, which is pretty amazing. These guys can actually take a decent amount of sun, which is really amazing. So especially if you live very coastally and you're in a cooler environment, you can give them full all day long sun, uh, which is great just as long as it's not gonna be planted up against like a cinder block wall or something that has a lot of radiant heat. So you wanna really be careful with that. Um, but full sun coastally is fine. A little bit of afternoon shade if you live more inland and you're in a hotter area, that would be really great as well. But they're very, very simple. When you get them, um, we also sell them in a variety kind of like this. So that way you can see what this looks like. When we get them when they're new, they're very small and low to the ground like this, but they have that beautiful red color, which is really amazing. So you get a lot of foliage color in these as well. And the nice thing about the Ito peonies is most of them have fragrance, which is amazing as well. And they make a really, really great cut flower. Um, when it comes to fertilizing, the real key that you want to uh, remember is you don't want a lot of nitrogen. So when you're buying your box of fertilizer, you wanna look, this has 484. This is the nitrogen. So you want this number low, you want the middle number high. That's the real key. So as long as you're not giving it too much nitrogen, you'll have really, really beautiful flowers. Um, when it comes to watering, once you get them established, they're pretty good. Um, they're not a low water plant necessarily. Uh, so two to three times a week watering. The real key is water deeply, but let the top of the soil dry out. Uh, that's the basic key for your watering with these and they are going to die down to the ground. So be prepared for that. And also remember, don't accidentally dig it up. So plant it in a spot where you remember where it's at because it is gonna die back down. And then just make sure you don't accidentally dig that plant up later, <laughs> forgetting that it's there. Um, but that's basically it. It's very, very simple. And look at these flowers. They come in a really beautiful range of uh, yellows to apricotty oranges to pinks and burgundies. Uh, the colors are fantastic and fragrance on a peony. How amazing is that? So growing Ito peonies, pretty simple, a little bit of an investment, but if you do it right, it gets better and better and better every single year. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, you can always check out all these great videos, tidbits and clips and all kinds of fantastic things on our Instagram and our Facebook page and check out our YouTube page, subscribe there. There's tons of really great videos there that you can watch that goes back years and years and years. So you get a lot of great information there as well. Uh, you can always shop our online boutique. We are open for curbside pickup as well. Um, and we offer local delivery here in uh, Orange County.
So thanks so much for tuning in. Bye guys.